Hi, I'm Robert Moody, music director, and welcome again to Online Insights, our webisode series here at the PSO. A great concert we have for you on Tuesday, Classical in October. We've entitled this concert, It Is Enough, and it features works by Brahms, Berg, and Sibelius. This concert features the great violin concerto of Alban Berg, one of the serialist composers of the early 20th century, and that's where we get the title for the concert, It Is Enough. Our guest artist, our soloist for the concert, is our very own concertmaster, Charles Dimmick, so I'm happy to have Charles here with me. Welcome, Charles. Thank you. And uh, tell us a little bit about this role you're going to play now as soloist on the stage versus sitting in the first violin chair as concertmaster. Are those two things different, and if so, how? They're really different, and this is interesting. You and I have, have not really had an occasion to do this yet. Um, I guess as a as concertmaster, I sort of view my job as being your right-hand man. I, I try to notice what you're listening for and try to listen to the other things, you know, and and sort of, sort of help anything that might be in the cracks, whereas when I'm soloist, I'm... I'm sort of relying on you for that instead. In fact, I, you, um, you said the words that crossed my mind. When, when you're a soloist or when one is a soloist, I want to be your right-hand man. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, and in this case, the piece we're talking about, just to talk a little bit about it, um, it's by Berg. So Schoenberg, Berg, Webern, these are names that people think of, 12-tone music. Um, should folks be scared of this piece? They shouldn't be scared of this piece. I mean, I think of all the 12-tone composers, Berg is certainly the most accessible because he's the most emotional yeah. of them all. I mean, it's it's extremely heartfelt music. Um, this audience up here, I don't think, has had much exposure to, to any of the 12-tone composers, but I think if you're going to have a first experience with any of them live, this would be the piece. I couldn't agree more. And in fact, I, I think that Berg, in my mind, Berg is the one who took this interesting intellectual idea of 12-tone music and turned it into real really beautiful melodic phrasing. Absolutely. And so framing this concert, which we've entitled It Is Enough, are two amazing works that are so much more than just enough. The Brahms Academic Festival Overture to kick off the concert, and then to finish the concert, the most powerful piece by Sibelius, his second symphony.